It's Jelani here with a team I like to have a rebound season in 2022 among the AFC. The Chargers, Ravens, and Broncos are teams that missed the playoffs last year that can definitely make deep playoff runs if things go as planned, but I believe many people are sleeping on the Colts. Indianapolis was 9-8 last year and finished second in the AFC South behind Tennessee. Their season ended with a bad loss against their rival Jaguars that kept them out of the playoffs, but they hope to keep that in the rear view. Now, a former MVP has arrived. Matt Ryan was acquired from Atlanta to upgrade from Carson Wentz. The Colts get an improvement at the position as their passing game last year was quite inconsistent. The former All-Pro is out to prove he can still put up good numbers and win games. His experience bringing Atlanta to the playoffs six times and throwing for 4,000 plus yards from 2011 through 2020 should help the Colts find stability. Michael Pittman Jr. is a guy to watch. Matt Ryan helped Julio Jones and Calvin Ridley improve their numbers as young receivers, so Pittman Jr. could benefit as well. The target share for him was 31% from week 13 to 18 to end last season. This indicates he's the clear number one receiver heading into 2022. The Colts are also one of the best teams in football when it comes to their offensive line and their running game. Their O-line is led by their duo of Quentin Nelson and Ryan Kelly. And if the MVP wasn't a quarterback award, Jonathan Taylor could have won it last year. Taylor has made his case for being one of the best running backs in football, running for north of 1,800 yards in 2021 and winning the rushing title. Now he's plus 1,000 to get the Offensive Player of the Year. Darius Leonard leads their defense that features the second best linebacker unit according to Pro Football Focus. The Colts are expected to be one of the better defenses in the league. Their line has Yannick Ngakwe joining forces with DeForest Buckner and they added star cornerback Stephon Gilmore to their secondary. Indy is a Super Bowl sleeper in a stacked AFC with the seventh best odds to represent the conference in the big game at plus 1200. For now, I like them to win the AFC South at minus 115 and to make the playoffs at minus 172. The Colts will be a tough out come January.